Hello and welcome to another video from Heartfield Automation. Today we're going to show you utilizing a sick safety light curtain in conjunction with a universal robot to put the robot into a safeguard stop pause mode and then resume when the safety reset button is pressed. So we now have triggered the safety light curtain. You see the LEDs turning red. We come over to the universal robot controller in the bottom left we have the yellow indication light letting us know that we have a safeguard stop. We come over and we've hit the reset button. Now that the operation has been cleared and the robot goes back into run mode. In order to accomplish this, we utilized a SICK safety relay. This is a UE4820S. The control circuit that we're using for stopping and starting the universal robot is the e-stop circuit, the safety circuit for the universal robot runs through 13 to 14 and 23 to 24. It's a dual channel safety. The light curtains are tied in on our channel 1 S12 and our channel 2 S31 with a, a connection between S22 to S21 to complete the, the safety circuit. And then we've wired S33 to S35 as an automatic reset for the safety. So the reason we have to do this is because of some of the safety light curtains. They come with a pulsing output that the universal robot cannot properly identify with. So that's the reason for going through the safety relay. We hope you enjoyed the video and look forward to talking with you soon.